The case is still ongoing and it is very active. Arguments by attorney and former federal judge UW Clemens before other federal judges may have killed Gardendale's effort to splinter away from Jefferson County schools. His fight won't end there. Past breakaway districts are in his crosshairs. Judge Clement says by no means does the Gardendale case end a 50-year battle to desegregate all of Jefferson County schools. And come August, there'll be a plan submitted for review to include five other districts that include Midfield, Trussville, Leeds, Hoover, and Homewood. The plan in concert with the Jefferson County School Board wouldn't blow up any school district, but... The end result may be that some of the uh, students presently in the county school system may be zoned into schools in Hoover and Trustful uh, and Leeds and Homewood. And Homewood. Of greatest concern, integrating the faculty. In Jefferson County, Clement says half of the students are African American, but only 18% of the faculty is black. Schools here have been ordered since 1968 to become unitary. A situation in which there are no longer black schools or white schools and identifiably so, but just schools. As for Gardendale's appeal, if it ultimately loses and is forced to pay all attorney's costs, the price is high. And it is well over a million dollars. The court fight that began in 1968 continues well into 2018. In Jefferson County, Jeff Eliasoff, WVTM 13.